Now let's start with um, removing this one from the cavity. Look at the parts. I would reckon that this this is small parts. They always put in in China. So let's see. I think it is. Let's see what in, what's inside. Inside there. Oh yeah. That's cheap ones. Should look like this. You can see this? That's the big one. Now this is the small one. So these must go. They must. So turn it around and take off the strings. <clears throat> yeah, I did catch a cold. I did. But I think I'm gonna survive. I'll always survive. Because that's just the way I am. What a great looking guitar. What a cheap guitar. Incredible what you get for your money. It's a good guitar too. But the pickups going. They're going. Yeah, they're going. Just loosen them a bit and you should be able to take them off. You should be able to take them off down there. Yeah, I'll lose it a little bit more maybe. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Here you go. So that's the way to pull off the strings from a less pole. That's the best way to do it, I think. So, uh, here we got the bridge. Well, you can't exactly call that for being slobby. No, it ain't. I have to roll down this one a little. It's a little out of tune. So I'll tune this intonation. The intonation. Oh shit. <laughs> well. A bridge should always look like this. That's the thick E, that's the thin E. Always going down and going back and going down. That's the high E, that's the low E. Just like this. I think I pretty much have this tuned. So now to pull off the pickups. Just pull them off. 
they're going. They're not usable. With feedback pickups. Farewell, my friends. You are going. You are going. So here we got to pick up with the red wire. I'll take off the screws. They fall off by themselves. Oh, I got so much slime. Oh, <laughs> delicious. I know that. Just don't talk about it. I won't. Good. That's the yellow wire. So now we know this is the bridge pickup and this is the neck pickup. So um, now we're gonna solder. Gonna make the soldering and then we're going to pull off these and put some other in. I have to have this one. No, maybe not. Well, I'll see. I'll see. So, uh, see you later, guys. So, what I'm about to do is to screw this thing off. Just like this. This is going to be a completely new guitar. A new guitar. Here you go. That's the best thing just to um, remove it all. You're gonna, you're gonna throw it away anyway, so out it goes. It's easier that way. It should be at least. This won't just won't go. Confusions! You have to go, little fellow. Little fellow, you have to go. So you might as well just give up and give it in and get out of my guitar. Just like he did. Oh, you saw how. Okay. Now, away it goes. This one too. This one too. Four of them. So, very magnetic. Magnetic. A magnetic pickup. That's why there's no such a thing like tone words. <laughs> because it ain't no mic, it's a pickup. Learn it. Learn it. Do you really think it would take up some vibration from, from the word? Tell me. Tell me if you really think so. And please give me some advice about how I can understand that. Give me some proof. Well, the red wire is is uh, the bridge pickup, so that'll go, and uh, the yellow, that's the neck pickup. It's going to. I'm going to remove it all, but before I'm going to do that, I'm going to see if this one will go down in that same hole, and it won't. That's what I thought. It's bigger, you see, so I have to thrill, thrill it out. I have to thrill it out. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to thrill it out. Can you do that? Or should I drill it out? I'll look at it. I'll be back. Well, I took off the neck mic. Here it is. And uh, I thought with the, the neck mic, the Seymour Duncan mic, and you have to, uh, if you're doing that, it's the, the ordinary way. The ordinary way! I can't talk today. Then you have to solder the red and white 
together because you ain't going to use that and then you're going to sort of the, the bare one and the green one together and the black one goes to the parts to the active so that's how you're going to do that so as you can see I removed all the parts inside they're gone so now I only miss the I don't miss it because I I didn't lose it but here it goes that is the bridge mic so I have to take these screw off just pay attention to how high the mic is that is very 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 important it sure is but you'll find out in time here it goes here it goes it goes that's why I'm turning off the camera every now and then because you don't want to see all this I reckon you don't I reckon you don't but this was the bridge pickup went away <sighs> yeah so now I'm gonna put on a new mics yeah, I'll be yeah. back. you have to um, you have to measure this you could uh, use this one that's out of plastic because you gotta know how wide this hole is and it's too narrow for this one it just won't go down there but you can use this one that's in plastic you can also get this one did you see the other one? was it in the camera? you can use this one, that's plastic you can use this one you see that it's got numbers so it's more precise so you can measure this that's 371 so you have to have a drill that's 371 yeah I guess the other one will be too big It'll be too big I guess much too big yes so I'll go with this one I think and then I'm gonna yeah that's 316 and this one is tree mm -mm 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 -mm. 346 so that's Zero point two three let's see nine eight seven nine millimeters eight point seven eight millimeters and if you take uh, this one it's approximately nine point six and this one is way too small but I'll try it anyway now wish me luck because the lagger on this one will go away I think but I'll try it I'll be back <laughs>